guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna be reviewing the the action figure hey, Bumblebee, and we're gonna be seeing how to transform it and how how good the wheels are, and we'll do all the recommends, seeing the stuff like that, and seeing my um, final thoughts about it at the end. So let's get started. All right, let's get started with the car mode. So he starts in his card mode. I don't like how it shows out there a lot, because you can tell right there. I don't know why that does that, but we got his wheel, the go turning wheel. So I detail on this character, the Jeep mode. Um, I like the arms. You can make him kind of like do a backflip on his car mode. And then put his wheel back and do a stop motion like that. Uh, yes, I do stop motion. But at the same time, um, I would recommend this. Because I feel like this um, and some other things would be really good. In your, if you have, Or if you're a Transformer collection, I feel like this car mode would be good. Um, let's try to start with the Transforming. And the wheels roll... Pretty decent. They roll pretty decent. Um, wait. Yeah, the roll, the wheels roll pretty decent. And it's like a back thing. The side. The other side. Front. We got the top. And bottom. Alright, let's get started with the transformation. So, the first step is you're gonna do is you're gonna pull this down. Pull this down. Alright. So then after you pull that down, you start the feet. Well, first you gotta do that. Put this up. Um, very act, uh, very, then you gotta unhook these parts. Unhook this. Pull this. Get this piece. Go up down, hook it, turn the feet, then you got this. Now, the last part is to get this piece, and you want to fold it down. Then you want to get the wheel, and what you want to do is you want to tuck it in. So I tuck in, but then... And then we got the one foot, and then do the same song on the other side. So I'll see you guys when I'm done with the other side. Oh yeah, I also forgot you gotta lift this up and this up. So gotta do that. And let's get. It. I'll do the air foot real quick, and I'll see you guys when I do that. All right, so I got the transformation pretty good. Uh, I got the feet. We will actually look at them when I'm done. So what you want to do now is lift this a little bit more down. Get this. Now this is going to be the tricky part. Lift this down. Get his head and pull out. So you want to pull his head out. And then lift his head out. And that's my brother in the background. So you guys know I want that yelling. That's my brother. So, so we got his chest. All right, I'll just redo that. So fold this in. Fold these up onto his chest. Get his uh, little things. Fold them back, all the way back, and do that. So now he's almost complete. Get the back part. Get the back uh, backpack, and then just. Try to get up. This is gonna be the most hardest part for me. <sighs> Should be a way that I could just easily just. And I'll see you guys when I get this part up. Okay, guys, I'm finally done with the transformation. He is finally done. And yeah, let me just uh, brighten it down a little. Or up. 
Hang on, guys. There we go. Okay, now that should be better. Now, tell me down in the comments. Yes, yes, yes. Go with my creation. Yes, my creation. Um, now, this is the transform mode. We have his, uh, what we have, he has his legs. See, he has his legs. He has stuff like that. It's at. In my opinion, I like the transfer mode better. It looks a lot more detailed, and it looks more realistic. I like the little uh, things right here. They're transparent, so I can see from the other side. So, like, I can see right there and stuff. It's actually really good. It's a good figure. Um, let's uh, get started with the posable. So, his posable work. Let's put him down in, like, his shooting. He does come with a... He did come with a blaster, but I accidentally lost it in my mom's bedroom, which it should be in there if Tiki did not swallow it, my puppy. She shouldn't. Um, so a good poseable, good pose. Uh, if the gun was here, I'll probably put him like that. If I had to pose him, but until I get my shelves up, can't pose him right now, so... Yeah, there we go. Oh, crap. Yeah. Well, this is a cardboard box, of course. Not it's going to stand good. So, um, we're going to see his head. So, his head, head pivot. Head pivot. Alright. It goes all the way around because it's on a ball joint. And it gets stuck on these little hooks. Good arm. About that high. About exactly t post. About exact t -pose. Uh, let's see, we're gonna go down, back down. His elbow. Elbow. Ooh, good elbow, good elbow. It's a pretty good elbow. Um. Let's see, we got good. Good leg kick. Um, the air side, of course, good leg pivot. Knee, up, knee. So his knee, good knee. Um, looks like the feet has good, it looks like it has good little, because it's on a ball joint right there, so it can move from either side. Um, it's on a ball joint, so it can do whatever it wants. See, and then you got a little bit on the sides. You can do a little bit of side pivots. Um, you got... What else? Alright. So, this figure out of nine is a very good figure for. For. That's my brother in the background. So, if you guys want. Hang on. Stay. Thank you. Okay. Now, this character is very good and all. It's a decent character. The transform mode, it's not hard to transform. Um, you can do like a couple steps and it'll be finished. Very simple. You just need to go to flow and just transform it and do all these little, just don't, like don't go rough on it. Just, just gently figure it out. Since I showed you how to transform it to the robot mode, I might, I'm thinking about it still, but I might not just because this video is long enough. Eight minutes is pretty good and um, stay tuned, I might make a video of an R character, and I might make a, I might make a another video today, there'll be three videos coming out today, there'll be one of Bumblebee, uh, there'll be one of a car, and there'll be one of World War II Hot Rod, so, if you guys want to stay tuned to those, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys next time, bye!